effective today. As Thomason finds Jennings, he looks out wide. Clark leaves it for Ashton, the captain today, Neil Ashton, who scored a wonder goal against Halifax on Tuesday night to book Wrexham's place in the semi-finals. The referee looked like he was going to blow for a foul on Maltler, and he didn't, and instead Wrexham play on. And it's Ashton through to Malt. Great touch by Malt. He lays it off to Evans. It's a goal for Wrexham. A wonder goal by Wrexham. It's Robbie Evans. He scored last time these sides met at the Hive. And Robbie Evans makes it Wrexham 1, Barnet nil. What a move. And the Wrexham fans and players celebrate duly. It was superb by Wrexham. Neil Ashton crafted a beautiful ball for Louis Malt. Louis Malt took the ball down so well. Gash looks to knock one on. Mai Smith and Stora under the ball, and they just about win it. Akinde on the edge of the box. Mai Smith doesn't leap well, and here's Akinde on the edge of the box. He goes down, and a dive, and he's off. He's been yellow card once. John Akinde has been sent off for Barnet for a dive. And Wrexham are playing against 10 men. And Yidem, who's had a frustrating day on the right wing for absolutely no reason, clips his man late. Yellow card, but Barnet's discipline is a real worry. I think if they've got any players left, they've got a game next Saturday, but I don't know if they'll have 11 men to the field. Here's Gash. Flicks one over. Good touch by McDonald. He's one on one. What a save by Cochran again. And that's the boys in red and black. And that's Joe Clark who gets the ball forward for Jennings. It's a four on three here for Wrexham. Jennings, they have men over. He curls one towards goal. It's off the post. It was saved by Graham Stack. What an effort by Connor Jennings that Louis Malt 